From VOA Learning English, this is the Education Report. Millions of high school students in China just took a college entrance examination. The highly competitive test is known as the Gaokao. It is meant to make the admissions system fairer for poorer students and those with less power in society. Education is very important to gaining a good standing in Chinese society. Universities are supposed to require good scores on the test for admission to college. But reports suggest that some people are getting into schools without even taking the test. This year, about 9 million students competed for about 7 million places in colleges. Every June, Chinese media usually report about the hard work and worry of students preparing for the Gaokao. This year, however, newspapers are writing stories about corruption at the country's top schools. One case involves Tsai Ranchang, the former head of admissions at Beijing's highly respected Renmin University. Mr. Tsai reportedly took money in exchange for approving admissions for students who did not take the Gaokao. China does have some policies designed to help students who do not do well on the Gaokao. Universities are permitted to admit a small number of first-year students for reasons other than high scores. They must show success in other areas like sports, interest groups, or community service. The policy is designed to help candidates whose abilities were not identifiable from the test scores. Chinese officials have banned trading university entry for money or favors. Earlier this year, the Ministry of Education demanded a more open and better supervised admissions system. For VOA Learning English, I'm Carolyn Pursuti.